Hi, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. Yeah, previously we were working with the BPI M6, the Banana Pie BPI M6, and it has some interesting features. Yeah, the, the Getting Started page shows that it has a 16 gigabyte eMMC flash. So it's got built in storage, and you can load Linux or Android onto the eMMC. Android will only go on the eMMC, so you have to use this Centery Sock system tool. There's the download link. I went ahead and downloaded it. You get this rare file, unpack that, and you get the V1321 folder, and that's the install. Well, I've already installed it, so this is what it looks like. There's two tabs, SBI Flash and eMMC. And that's where you would burn the image to the eMMC. They recommend that you erase the eMMC first before you burn a new image to it. You can see on the right hand side of the screen there, there's messages as well. All right, the first thing you want to do is hold down the USB button. It's right next to the USB C port on the board. There we go, we're plugged in. Now look at the message. It says device join in, but then it says dev13 enter uboot mode again. It didn't like something. It's not going to let me erase it. You don't see the erase button light up. I must have just got my timing off or something. And it also won't you, let you switch between eMMC and SPI flash while it's connected. So we unplug it, hold down that USB button again. Now you see dev13 remove, plug it back in, now we get the message dev13 join in, dev13 is in u-boot mode already, and we can select the device, yeah, in the instructions they say here, I, line 5, if you want to erase the eMMC, you can repeat the above steps, but you need to click the Erase eMMC instead of Starting Burn. So there's the Erase button. Go ahead and click it. And it's erasing. Now this actually took about a minute and a half. I cropped that out. You see it said Start Erasing. Yeah, it's about a minute and a half. There, it's finished. And we could theoretically browse to an image file and do an image burn. Now you may have to exit U-boot mode and then come back in U-boot mode holding that USB button and then you could burn your image. I'm thinking I'm going to use the Sunry Sock system tool to load the Android image on my BPI M6 first because yeah you see here the Synaptics VS680 that's the processor on there it's got a GPU and NPU, but these uh, benchmark, AI benchmark tests are APKs, so that's going to run on Android. So that's why I want to run Android first. Stay tuned. It's going to get, get interesting, hopefully. Yeah, download direct APK. Yeah, direct APK download. Give this video a like. Leave a comment down below, and before you go watch more of my Banana Pie, Bee Pie M6 videos, please click on subscribe. Thank you very much.